Breaking, now we know who really tried to hack the election. The great underground writer Jim Goad has a theory. In regards to social justice warriors, they always project. They'll try to hurt you with the very things that hurt them. The Democrats are like that, they're accusing Trump of doing something they did. Specifically, Obama and his cronies used domestic intelligence networks to spy on the Trump team. They also tried to hack the 2016 election. This news comes after similar reports surfaced proving that the Obama administration illegally spied on average Americans for years using the NSA. Via Circa For all their posturing about Russia being a police state, the Obama administration sure acted like authoritarians while they were in power. During his time in office, Obama routinely reviewed messages that went back and forth between American citizens and foreign states. Former Obama intelligence officials have admitted that their boss abused Section 702 of the Foreign Intelligence Surveillance Act in order to keep eyes on electronic communications. Via New York Post All these actions violated the Fourth Amendment. In sworn testimony, former CIA director, John Brennan, admitted that he attached a dossier containing information about possible Russian connections to the Trump transition team to a report that was received by Obama. Brennan also admitted that despite having zero evidence of collusion between Trump, his team, and Russia, he still went ahead and suggested that Obama conduct an investigation into the 2016 election. Via New York Post Even if some collusion proves to be true, as in the case of Jared Kushner, supposedly, there is no evidence that any laws were broken. Everything is completely above board, just as Trump has told us time and time again. The media simply won't listen. In regards to Brennan's politically motivated dossier, former Obama-era intelligence official, James Clapper, characterized the documents as forgettable because the sources could not be verified. During his time as head of the CIA, Brennan, a former supporter of the American Communist Party, thoroughly politicized the agency, and openly acknowledged his preference for the Democrat Party. During the 2016 election, the sycophant Brennan colluded with British and Estonian intelligence officials in order to spread misinformation about Trump's ties to Russia. Via Front Page Mag all of this was done because Brennan believed that, if elected, Hillary Clinton would name him the new director of the CIA. Each new revelation about the Obama White House confirms our worst suspicions about the Democrats. It is they who routinely jeopardized our national security with their politicization of everything.